other times you said you were very busy and didn't have enough time to spend time with god you know those times those times when what you crave most is free time so that you can just immerse in god's presence now you are in a free time and you are still not spending time with god so what's it really about is it not having time for real or is it that when you become free as much as we want to do it there just seems to be other entertaining things to do here's the thing when we are at our freest we indulge in the things that our hearts desire the most you may say oh well i don't agree because i started doing this thing because i was just free but deep down what your heart has desired is entertainment freedom you know endless scrolling and now that's what you're doing and you'll realize that it's in these times that your mind is most vulnerable this is the time when the enemy is going to attack your mind from nowhere it's going to show you how people are moving on in life and your life is on hold it's going to show you how incompetent you are it's going to make you downplay the great things you have achieved in the past it's going to just bring to your mind how much your life doesn't mean a thing and that's why at your most vulnerable moments which are the times when you want to stay entertained the most those are the same times you must keep guard over your mind if you're a Nigerian currently living in Nigeria right now so many things must be toying with your mind you must have gotten frustrated over encouraged yourself gotten frustrated again and encouraged yourself again and I can't tell you it's a cycle that's gonna stop really really soon but here is what the victory is not that you never face problems but that you are able to fight and resist the Bible says resist the devil and he will flee from you now, your strength doesn't come from the fact that the enemy never even tries to resist you or anything, but you winning the battle by resisting him and standing your ground on what Christ has given unto you. You see, it's very interesting that we say, oh my God, if I'm just free, if I no longer have exams, I'm going to do that video. I'm going to spend that time. And then the time comes and then you just don't feel like. And that's why importantly, you don't do spiritual things by feeling. Yes, I know the feeling is good. I know it feels amazing. Worship music, everything. I remember there was a time I told God when my phone was dead that God, I have to wait to pray later. And he was like, why? And I was like, there's no worship music. <laughs> and I could feel him rebuke me like, you cannot be basing your worship of me, your conversations with me, your time with me on the melody, on how you feel. It is not about your feelings. It is about what is. Once you believe the truth, do the truth. Whether you feel good about it or not. Thank you guys for watching. God bless you. Bye-bye.